Hello, and welcome back to Pokemon Desolation. Last time, things happened. This time, more things are going to happen. Let's continue on. Welcome to the Blackview Battle House. This year, we're hosting the Battleview Tournament. This year, we're being sponsored by the Club Guru. I can see that you've already signed up, so maybe we should get started right away. Only eight candidates are selected to take part in the Celia Finals, and we're only allowed to choose the top two from here. So you have to win as many battles as you can to qualify. Your Pokemon are healed at the end of every round. Each round is a six on six double battle. Okay, good to know. When you're ready to begin, come see me. A six on six double battle. All right. Win the Battle View Tournament. Are you ready for your first battle? Yes. Great. Head into the next room and stand in the left hand square. Is it starting? The trainers are both here. It's starting. Trainers. This is a six on six double battle. Now is the time to show off the might you have hidden. Begin. My name's Amil Amila, Amila, Amila. My name's Amila. I've been training for a long time and I'm certain you're no match for me. I won't go easy on you. Okay. I'm a little scared. Delcaddy and Crawdont. I don't like that. Oh, wow. Wait, they're only level 39 and 38. Huh. Okay. No. How'd you win? I thought I was strong enough. Mark. Mark. The winner is Mark. We look forward to seeing you for round two, Mark. You beat me fair and square. I'll be rooting for you. Congratulations on your victory. Are you ready for your next battle? Great. Head into the next room and stand in the left hand square. This should be an interesting experience. Round two is starting. The trainers are both here. Go Mark. Welcome to round two of the qualifiers. Trainers, this is a six on six double battle. Now is the time to show off the might you have hidden. Begin. I'm Arthur. It's a pleasure to meet you. Now, shall we get on with it?
Intriguing. That was dazzling. I would most love to battle you again someday. Come see me later. The winner is Mark. We look forward to seeing you for round three, the, se the semi-final, Mark. Are you ready for the semi-finals? You're my opponent? Pathetic. Oh, wow. Okay. Is the semi-final about to start? I'm so excited. Welcome to the semi-final of the qualifiers. Trainers, this is a six-on-six -six double battle. If you have any aces left, it may be the time to bring them out. Begin. I don't really need to bother with introductions. Just let me sweep the floor with you. Shall we? Oh, wow. Very confident. Lorantis and Comfy. Shouldn't be a problem. What the? What the? You absolute cheater. There's no way I'd lose to a kid like you. They were supposed to be shouting my name, not yours. Well, unfortunately, young lady, the winner is Mark. We look forward to seeing you for the final, Mark. Next up is the finals. I'm so excited. Your opponent is incredibly powerful. They kept talking about blowing the opponent. Blowing the opponent back when they arrived. Are you ready to take the challenge? Yes. Okay. Stand at the entrance and prepare. Look, it's Mark. It's the final. Let them concentrate. Welcome to the final round of the Battleview Qualifiers. Our final contestants are Mark and Elite Trainer Shane. Okay. Trainers, this is a six on six double battle. Pull out all fronts. This is the decider for the top. Begin. Cherum and Reunigris. Or Runigris. Runrigris.
What? Wow. That is very unlucky. I thought we'd be able to finish the Blastoise. The winner of the Blackview segment of the Battleview Tournament is Mark. Congratulations, Mark. Those battles were spectacular. Congratulations on your victory. Not only do you qualify for the Celia Finals, but you've earned these rewards. And EXP all. Very cool. Field effect readout 31. Info on Starlight Arena now available. Five credits. And finally, here is your official battle pass for the Battleview Finals in Celia City. Thank you. We hope to see you soon, trainer. All right, cool. Oh, hey there. My girlfriend and I have always wanted to set up a daycare business, but, well, we don't have enough credits. And without credits, we can't kit out our house. I've tried finding work, but it's so hard in this city. You look strong. Could you help us out, perhaps? We don't need much, trainer. Once our business kicks off, we'll be making credits in no time. I'll offer you our service for a discounted price, please. We only need 12 credits. Can you help us? I can. Oh my. Oh my god. Who knew such kind people still existed? Thank you, Mark. Thank you so much. I'll get started straight away. Come by sometime. Hey, Mark. You can now call me the daycare guy. What? Is it bad for guys as young as me to be in charge of a daycare? Let me prove you wrong. Anyway, on to business. Any Pokemon you'd like to have raised will be left in my girlfriend's care. For some reason, I expected the daycare couple to be older. If I leave Ditto in there, I'll make a fortune. I'm just waiting for my Pokemon back. The book in front of me contains a bunch of notes I wrote about how to breed the perfect Pokemon. Feel free to give it a read. It's a book labeled How to Breed the Perfect Pokemon. Which chapter would you like to read? Um, I don't really want to read right now. I'll look at it later if I ever need a, if I ever need to uh, to breed some Pokemon. Hey, Mark, I'm the daycare girl now. We can raise Pokemon if you'd for you if you'd like. Would you like us to raise one? Uh, no. Fine. Come again. All right. Trainer, you have returned. Perhaps that means you are willing to donate to Jared's cause and furnish his humble abode. Excellent, excellent. The first item Jared requires is a lawnmower. How else, of course? Will Jared be able to keep the area around his abode clean of that nasty grass? 
I think one of those will cost about 7,500. Is that a price affordable to you, trainer? Oh, you can donate that amount. Excellent, excellent. Jared is in your debt, trainer. Mark gave Jared 7,500 to purchase a lawnmower. The sweet smell of money. If only Jared's wallet didn't fall from his attire. Jared will purchase this lawnmower right away. All right, well, there's a lawnmower. It's a high-tech Blackview styled lawnmower. Why Jared would need this in a city with little to no grass is unclear. Let one of your Pokemon play with the lawnmower. Okay. Like a responsible trainer, you don't let your Pokemon near the lawnmower. So yeah, I'm assuming this is for Rotom to get the different Rotom forms. I don't have a Rotom, nor do I know where to get a Rotom. So, uh, yeah. Jared is in your debt, trainer. The money you donated allowed the purchase of the finest of lawnmowers. No longer will Jared allow those pesky grass types to disturb this humble abode. All of this work, however, has made Jared quite hot. Of course, one would normally cool down by removing articles of clothing but Jared is already at his limit. <laughs> Perhaps the next item of need in this home is a fan to keep Jared cool. Of course, the climate of Blackview is not exactly forgiving to poor Jared. Jared believes the purchase of a fan in Blackview to cost approximately 7,500 is that a price affordable to you, trainer? Uh, no, it is not. Not right now. Oh, you do not wish to help Jared. That's fine. No grudges are held here. Sad face. All right, well, we'll be back when we have uh, money to spare to help Jared get a, get a fan. We will return eventually. Okay, so now we are going to try to complete the side quest, Serenity's Request. So we have to bring a photo of Kenneth Caves, Vire Altar, and Weeping Hill. So, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Seems like a good place to take a picture for Serenity. Wield the dagger and take a picture. You raise the camera. Hey you, what do you think you're doing? You can't just come in here and photograph us like that. Take this. Scoundrel. We need backup. What the? You two. What is the meaning of this? This trainer. They, uh... Are you a fool? This is Mark. Mark? You mean... The one that saved us? Yes. Now get out of here, you buffoons. Uh, yes, yes. Deepest apologies, Mark. Forgive us. 
Mark, it is good of you to return to our village. Apologies about the others. Some people here don't actually know you or know what you've done for us. Here, I hope this makes up for it. It belonged to Kyuki before... It belonged to Kyuki before, so I'd be glad to see it gone. An odd incense. It's been good seeing you, despite the context. Farewell. The photo still appears to be in good condition, and shows both villagers and shows both villagers outside the entrance to the village. Okay. Okay, yeah, village is still closed off. Seems like a good place to take a picture for Serenity. Wield the dagger and take a picture. You raise the camera. The tree started moving. It's a wild Trevenant. The Trevenant didn't appreciate its picture being taken. The Trevenant attacked. Level 58. The Trevenant fled. The dagger is glowing in odd color, as though alive. The color faded. You look at the camera. The photo is still inside. Seems like a good place to take a picture for Serenity. Wield the dagger and take a picture. You raise the camera. A Darumaka? The Darumaka grabbed the camera. Okay. You take the camera back. The photo is still inside. All right, so now we need to return to Serenity. Is that a photo of villagers from the Kenneth jungle? Ah, I see. So they were frauds after all. Whatever the case, thank you, trainer. That's a photo for the collection after all. That's a photo of Vire Sanctum. Look, I can see the Moltres statue. That's another photo for the collection. Thank you so much. That's a photo of the Weeping Hill. Oh, the tree attacked you, and the dagger glowed. When my parents died, they were buried at the Weeping Hill. Perhaps they know about this pilgrimage. Here, this may help you stop being attacked in the future. A cleanse tag. Okay. That's another photo for the collection. Thank you so much. That's three locations already. I wish I had something to give you, but I'm sorry. You've been so helpful so far. Maybe take a break before we continue. 
Thanks again, trainer. Hey, Mark. I'm generally in charge of lost and found jobs. That's pretty much where trainers lose their Pokemon, and we have to find them. I've got a couple for you to do, if you're interested. This is what I've got for you. Okay. Find my Seviper. So recently, a trainer and his Seviper were traveling through Silver Forest. They heard an unusual cry, a dog barking, followed by some thunder. The Seviper got loose and went to investigate. Unfortunately, the trainer lost the Seviper. Now it's up to us to find the Seviper and the cause of this problem. Reward, five credits, a Thunderstone, and 2k. You want to do this job? Yes. The last known location of Seviper was Eastern Silver Forest. Well, get going then. Find the missing Seviper in Silver Forest. Oh. My. The wild Raikou is angry at the Seviper. Attempt to calm it down. Sure, why not? Level 50. Okay, we're good. The Raikou fled. Seviper looks at you with gleaming eyes. The Seviper seems ready to return to the Rangers Guild. but a Raikou in Silver Forest. How bizarre. I guess it's a mystery to be solved another day. This is your cut. Good job. My son is lost. This one is actually kind of an emergency. A little boy went into the Adenfall Woods the other day. Hasn't been seen since. No one knows what happened to him. There have been searches, but no results. That's where we, the Rangers, come in. Your job will be to find the boy and send him home. Reward, three credits and 1800. Great, go and look around the Adenfall Woods. I'll look forward to hearing from you. Okay. Locate the lost child in Adenfall Woods. Oh no. That's not good. Please, help me. That Pokemon kidnapped me. While I was out, next to the stream, 
Help. Okay. Why? Please do not use hypnosis. Thank you. The hypno appears panicked. That's right, you monster. Scram. Hypno fled. Thank you, trainer. You saved me. Honestly, you're the best. I'm gonna go home now. Thanks again. You want a job. Make sure your team is tough for these, okay? Great. Let's get started then, huh? This is what I've got for you. Fight the foxes. The black foxes aren't generally our concern, see? But they've been causing a few too many problems lately. We don't like getting involved, but sometimes we've gotta. And that comes down to you and I. So we'll start with small steps for now. There's a group of foxes over on Route 4 in the Hardin Mountain. I want you to go and deal with them. Reward. Four credits, a white herb, and 1700. You game? Good. They'll be inside the Hardin Mountain somewhere. That's on Route 4. Good luck, mate. Battle the foxes inside Hardin Mountain. Okay, well, we found him. Huh? Who do you think you are? Some hotshot punk, maybe. Maybe we should beat him up. Send him back with a message from the foxes. Yeah, yeah. I like that idea. How about it, team? Beat him up, boss. Just get it over with. I'm gonna... Okay. Alright then.
What the? I lost. I didn't think such a basic kid could. You're just weak, man. I'll take them easily. Alright, kid. Time to show you how it's done. We are not in a good spot. Well, hey, uh, you want to help? 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 Are you stupid? Retreat, you idiots. They're better than us. But run. Teach him a lesson. This one's an easy one. Some wannabe gang was seen defacing the old ranger's base in Blackview. That building was once very important to us. I want you to go there, find the upstarts, and put them in their place. Some scare tactics would be fine. Maybe you could sort this one out. Reward, 3 credits and 1800. Good job but the job's not done yet. The old ranger's base is in South Blackview. Go teach him a lesson. Defeat the, wait. That says, Wanable? Defeat the Wanable gang at the old ranger's base in Blackview. Huh? Who are you? What? Have you not learned about how to mind your own business? What? You think I'm doing something wrong? How about you sot off before I kick you in the face? Not going, huh? Sure you want to mess with me? Disrespectful little... You know what? Fine gives me an excuse to put you in the ground. Sorry, but not really. Okay. But you, what? Yeah, I get it, okay? I lost. Don't hurt me. We'll go, okay? I just didn't expect that I'd get beaten so easily by... Never mind. We're out of here. Rangers. This mission is a big one. I'll put I'll put that out there now.
Rangers. This mission is a big one. I'll put that out there now. Alright. Blackview City. The second biggest city in the entire region. There's no police countermeasure. And so gang activity is crazy high. In fact, we have got driven out of our base there a few years ago. But I've decided we need to re-establish some ground there. I've already talked it over with the contact there, Cody. Cody has a plan to combat the other gangs in Blackview with, well, a Rangers gang. Oh my. You'll meet Cody and help him establish this new group. Reward, six credits, an ice stone, and 2200. Time to go then. You'll find Cody in Blackview City's Fight Club. It's hidden underneath a bar that's in the middle of the city. Oh, you're a ranger. Name's Cody. You were sent by Dan. Old rascal. Haven't seen the guy in years. You must not be too bad if you were allowed down here. So let's get straight to it. Blackview is owned by gangs, more or less. You should know this. So to reestablish the ranger's presence here, well, we need to make our own gang. Yeah, I know, it sounds crazy, but I've got a plan. I've got some boys already prepared. We just need a couple more helpers, then we'll be ready. Helpers for what? Really? Well, beating a rival gang and stealing their base, of course. Look, mate, just think like me for a second. I need you to be smart about this. I need you to go north of the market and meet up with someone and, well, recruit them. I need you to recruit Brutus. You know, the guy you humiliated. Yeah, he's still bumbling around north of the market, but we could use his help. I'll get the rest of the boys ready. After you're done, meet me back here. Convince Brutus to join the gang. Okay. You're back, huh? What do you want? Need some help fighting a gang, huh? Yeah, I'll help you. On one condition. I want a rematch for earlier. I want to prove to everyone that I didn't get beaten. You up for that, trainer? Good. Let's do it right now. I'm gonna get you back, that's for sure. Okay. You have a Mega Metacham? Okay, that was a little scary. Okay. 
That was impressive. Yeah, I get it. You're better than me. I've got your back, trainer. I'll help you out. The Rangers Guild, though? I never thought I'd be helping your kind. Report back to Cody. I see you got a helper, and it didn't even take you long. Okay, we're gonna meet at the southeast port. I know where the target base is, so I'll lead the way. The gang itself is pretty small. So small, they don't even have an established name. Which means, this should be easy. Southeast port, I'll meet you there, mate. Meet up with the gang at the port. Mark, you're here. I suppose it's time then, huh? Are you ready to rumble? Then let's get down to business. I was gonna sort out an elaborate plan, but uh... I thought bust in the front door and just charge in was good enough. So that's exactly what we're going to do. Mark, their new base is the house just north of me. You know, the one with the old flower sign on it. Let's take on these hooligans, shall we? People, move out. Mark, Cody is out back with their ringleader. Help him out. What are you doing here? This is our base. Mark, glad you could back me up. This guy's tough. I need a hand. He might have, well, beat me. This is quite simple, Ranger. This is our new home. I would appreciate it if you'd be kind enough to leave now. Mark, I need your help. You want to have an attempt. Fine. 
let me show you some traditional battling. Noctowl. Please don't miss. Good. It's good damage. It's a good miss. Okay, that was a little scary for like a second. I didn't expect such expertise. Perhaps I myself require more training. Fine. You have clearly won where I have failed. You want this building? Take it. Farewell. Top-notch effort. I'm surprised, actually. That guy was tough, but you had no trouble at all. I suppose our work here is done. Meet me out front when you're ready. Not a bad effort. I think I'll stick around. Join this little rangers group. I've already decided I own this couch. Okay. Mark, Mark, great to see you. You did a great job helping us out. I ain't gonna lie, I'm really pleased with the results. I don't have much to offer you myself, except my thanks. But hey, when I've got this up and running, I can bring you, I can bring you help when you need it. Okay, I think we're done here for today. So, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time with some more Pokemon Desolation. Again, thanks for watching. Peace out.